servicemen in conditions as close to real as possible heavy assault actions, both beginners and experienced soldiers of the 63rd Mechanized Brigade participate in the coordination. Now we are honing, facing the tank, as well as the landing of troops and also the dismounting of the infantry. People come to us from training centers. We also test their knowledge, work with them, from the squad leader to the battalion chief sergeant. We test their skills and improve them. Denis was mobilized six months ago. In 2015, the guy served as an artilleryman, and now he's a tank gunner, he says. When he went to war, soldiers were needed for the crew of armored self-propelled vehicles. Now he serves on a modernized version of the T-72 tank. Here the thermal imager is installed. There were no thermal images on Soviet samples. Aiming is a little easier than in Soviet tanks. More advanced. Aiming is easier than in Soviet models. The range is 8 kilometers. These machines have been upgraded in Europe. They were handed over to Ukraine as part of international assistance. These tanks of the 63rd Mechanized Brigade were provided to us by Western partners. They are modernized and in good condition. We are well trained, ready to perform any combat missions on them. Especially at night. We now have a good view of the enemy, so we can destroy them both day and night. These options give us advantages to survive and destroy the enemy. One of the most difficult elements of training is the so-called facing the tank. Soldiers digging in at speed should lie face down on the ground. About 50 tons of iron pass above them. After the military must quickly get up and continue the assault. The military says it's an endurance mission. There's no place for panic. They say in the brigade that their task is to hold the front line in the Luhansk direction. Our brigade is now performing combat missions in the Uman direction. This is the Krimina direction. There is a positional defense now. Artillery and mortars are in work, as a rule. Well, as always, Russia uses rocket attacks. The Ukrainian soldiers carry out their combat missions, carry out them with honor and as productively as possible. The enemy in this direction of the armed forces of Ukraine is the regular troops of the Russian Federation. Reported by Diana Kulesnik, Anastasia Volkova, Artem Voronin, UATV News.